Hello friends. Today I am explaining one more CK editor plugin. Uh, the name of the plugin is the color button, right? So the default installation of CK editor, you know, default installation of CK editor in Drupal uh, has a lot of options. But you can also add more features with the help of CK Editor plugins. CK Editor is an open source editor and has a wide range of extra plugins. So we can implement the extra plugin with the help of uh, with the help of uh, Drupal plugin system, right? So one uh, today we are trying to add one more plugin. Uh, of CK editor, which is called the color button with the help of contributed module, right? We can uh, install extra plugin with the help of contributed module or with the help of custom module, right? So if you, you can see on a screen, we have a one contributed project. We have one contributed project. The name of project is like uh, drupal.org, drupal.org color button, right? So this is the, this is CK editor related, uh, plugin related project, right? So first of all, we have to install, we have to download this module with the help of composer command. So I am just uh, copy this command and I have just logged in with the SSH. So I have put there, ddev SSH. Then we can run the composer command, right? Once the module is download, then we have to enable the module. Before enabling the module, we need to download one libraries, download libraries from here, right? So I have opened this URL. Then we have to download this library and extract this library in uh, extract this library on libraries folder in drupal root right so the library is downloaded i am going to show in the folder page so in the folder page and i am just uh, extract this file extract this file the color button plugin so i am just extracting with the documents folder within the sites folder in the sites folder, we are going to just Drupal project and within the Drupal project, we are going to the web directory and libraries directory. I have extract this libraries on the Drupal project, right? I'm just uh, open the uh, web folder and libraries folder. So we have two library, one for div plugin and one for color button plugin, right? So once the upload the libraries, download and upload the libraries, then I need to install the module. Module. So I am just logging with the Drupal admin and uh, go to the go to the module section and enable this module. So I am just uh, click the extract section, extend section. Once the download is completed, then I am just. Uh, click the extend section and enable this module means install this module, right? So in extend, in extend page, in extend page, uh, we can see color button module of CK editor, right? So within the CK editor folder, we have just search the color button plugin, right? So I'm just put control F. So we have a color button module. I'm just trying to searching here. CK editor color button, right? This is the plugin. I am just install this plugin. And we have the required module CK editor, CK editor filter and panel button also. So I am just clicking the panel button also module and click the install button, right? After install this module, we need to 
config uh, these option in our editor configuration. So I am just uh, go to the configuration page, editor configuration page. I am just opening the configuration, then content authoring, the text formatter and editor. So I have uh, opened the page full HTML, full HTML container, right? Full HTML container. Once the module is enabled, then we need uh, uh, run the CR command. After run the drus CR command, we need to config the editor. So with uh, we have just config this editor. Then we have a new option, which is called color button option, right? Color button option and uh, panel option, right? So once the module is enabled, editor config show group name. So we uh, we are getting one error the panel button required library. So uh, we need to download the panel button libraries. So how we can download the panel button libraries? I am just open the URL of panel button and directories. So I am just open this URL and we have to download the panel button libraries. This is the panel button library. We need to download this panel button libraries and extract this panel button libraries in our Drupal libraries folder. So I have downloaded this library and just show in folder and just uh, click on the extract uh, button and just extract the library on our Drupal. Go to the documents, go to the sites folder within the sites folder. I have just uh, go to the setup, just uh, open the web folder and within the libraries folder, I need to upload the panel button libraries. So panel button libraries. So we have overall three libraries. One is called div plugin. One is for color button plugin and one is called panel button plugin. So now I have uploaded the library. So I am trying to reinstall the plugin, right? which is called the CK editor plugin and button plugin. I have just checked the plugin and click on the install button, right? So now the library's requirement is fulfilled. So I am just trying to install this module. So now you can see uh, two module is enabled, CK editor button, color button and panel button, right? So this is the content page. I am just clicking the basic uh, page content, right? Basic page content. So this is the screenshot of color, uh, color button plugins, right? Color button plugins. So I am just show before enable this button on our editor, how the editor is look like. And after enable this button, what, what will changes means uh, what is look like the editor, right? So I'm just uh, clicking the add content page and I have just checking the color button plugin, right? So now once the plugin is enabled, then you can see there is the option color button, right? Font color button. So I'm just open, open the add container page. Then I can, uh, I, module is enabled then i am run i have run the cr command after running the cr command successfully i am just uh, open the editor configure page right so there is no option there is no uh, you can see there is no option uh, this color option there is no this color option right now so once the enable on this editor so i have just reload the uh, configure editor page then you can see one new option of here there is the color button right this text color and the background color right so i am just open this uh, and the formatting toolbar right so formatting toolbar uh, formatting toolbar here i am just adding this option or we can add this option on formatting toolbar here Right. So this is the I have added the color button option. There is the background color or 
one is the background color and one is for font color right then i am just click the save configuration page means our active editor uh, these two option is added right so after save this configuration we need to just run drus cr one more time so i am just running drus cr once the drus cr is run successfully then we can check the editor configuration right so once the configuration is saved and the drus cr running successfully then we can just reload this option then we can see the full html format right because we have added uh, those two option on the full html format so i have just shipped our code to basic html to full html formatting right So uh, now you can see the format configuration is saved. We got the message, the text format full HTML has been updated. Then the CR is completed successfully. Then we can just reload the admin config page. So full HTML option, uh, full HTML option will we show one, uh, two additional button, which is called the font color and background color, right? So I am just refreshing the page. Uh, we have to wait for five to 10 seconds. Once the page is uploaded, then we have to check the option is enabled or not in CK editor. So now you can see there is the two new option, one for font color and one for the background color. So we have type some string like test, then we have just select this string then we have just select the color. Then you can see the font color is changed, right? Then we can just put this. So there is option, two option, one for the background color, the style color this and background color also. So we have a two option, one for background color and one for text color. So this is the additional plugin of CK editor. Thank you.